but how about you my brother mambo vp yeah, that's swahili number yeah. one okay number two english okay ciao come state what that's is italian that? italian yeah and also uh, i can speak uh, uh, some japanese i can speak japanese konnichiwa oh genki desu ka oh very nice yoko soto modachi oh yeah this yeah. guy is so talented for sure so uh, anyway how how if i want to greet somebody in in which language italian, italian. how can i like greet somebody ciao ciao is like a hello ciao 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 is like a hello yeah and how do you respond maybe someone ciao ciao you say ciao ah ciao ciao another word you want to teach me at least two words ah come Hey what's up guys what's up my people welcome again to our family so in case if you're a new one my name is Wege MBC welcome to the new video new day new video uh, today as you can see I'm with my friend right here actually we're in the down in the street right now as you can see some environment you see down in the street so we're just chilling under the shadow see trees yeah so you see so here we are this is way game and in case if you're a new one make sure you hit the subscribe button just to support your boy right so today i'm with my friend right here he will introduce himself so you'll get to know what is his name uh what is his nationality you know yeah because right here we have people from zambia kenya south africa tanzanians a lot of them so maybe i'm with a new one today so we get to know oh. so mambo vipi poor, poor. Yeah, yeah so sana. Uh, i was trying to greet him in my native language but i will I'll speak English to, with him actually because as you know all videos I'm using English English because a lot of people you know my brother I have a lot of audience from outside the Tanzania right, so right, we right. don't understand they don't understand the Swahili so in order to make sure everyone to understand this uh, we have to rule we have to use this international language you know even Chinese can understand us and uh, like Indians everyone so let's start interview right now let me ask him some few questions so you can introduce yourself yourself one time bro uh, my name is mike okay uh, mike from arusha okay live and work in arusha okay yeah very nice bro uh but, wa so, okay but most of the time i travel out of yeah i don't stick just at one place okay. i've been in different places of the world okay yeah i love traveling man yeah that's nice but bro. my favorite is hiking hiking so much Right, that's cool, that's yeah, cool. Yeah. Um, how long have you been here in Arusha? Uh, over 20 years. Over 20 years? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. yeah, over 20 years, is, it's, not, uh, it's, it's not easy, guys, to survive in this city, you know. This city has a lot of things to do, like, uh, some, sometimes, you know, everywhere we have, uh, everywhere we have uh, good and uh, bad people, you know. But here, a lot of people are so nice few bad people because no place where we they don't have any any kind of food that so let me back to you bro uh, what are you advising people who want to visit this place uh, just I just want to tell them Arusha is a safe place to be okay and then in case uh, uh, in case of anything we have so much to do we have lots of activities you can do hiking you can do like a canoe but we don't have ocean around here so don't expect that you'll see beach. Okay. We only miss. We have everything expect except. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No white sand around here. No oh. white sand. 
Okay. Yeah. And um, what uh, what are you advising people they should do before to come to Tanzania? Ah. Or what they should prepare? Just what do you tell them? Uh, exactly foreigners, you ah. know, expect, uh, especially yeah. foreigners. First of all, before you get here, you have to prepare yourself. You have at least to have a budget. Okay. Yeah, because Arusha yeah. is totally different compared to other to other cities. Okay. Because it's a center of tourism, yeah. tourism, so almost everything the price is a bit higher. So, yeah. Okay. Um, which places will you advise them to visit in Arusha? Uh -huh. We have like a falls, yeah. like a waterfalls. Yeah. We have Arusha Park, yeah. where you can be able to see Mount Meru. You can yeah. see wild animals. Yeah. You can also access to see Mount. Kilimanjaro. One time, guys. Uh, in November. In November 8, I will go to uh, Arusha National Park. So he mentioned it. So I will be there in November 8. Yeah, just the next month. I will be there. I'm already booked my ticket. You know, we have a team, so we will go there. So let's 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 listen to him. What he's telling us. I just wanted to tell you that I will be there one time. All right, you are most welcome, and then uh, expect much. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Uh, like. Um, uh, which kind of food? Food uh, is a, which kind of food uh, foreigners like most here in Tanzania? Aha, uh -huh, most of them. According you know, to our according to our natural food, yeah. It's interesting because uh, most of them once they, they hit here, once they get here, yeah, yeah, we're trying to recommend them to have ugali. Okay. Yeah, ugali. <laughs> that it's uh, like a. Yeah. Okay. Actually, guys, ugali. Ugali is a uh, very popular food in Africa. As you can watch my previous videos, you will see one of them I'm trying, I'm trying to cook Ugali. So Ugali uh, is very famous food in Africa, and, uh, but uh, here in Tanzania we call it Ugali, and in Kenya too. But uh, when you go in Zambia, they call it Nsima. In South Africa, they call it PAP, P-A-P. You know, but when you order PAP, they will give you the same thing. So Ugali is uh, very popular around Africa actually. So, uh, have you, is it your favorite food too? Uh, interesting. I have so much uh, favorite food, but that is number one. Yeah. That's number one because we grew. We yeah. grew eating yeah. that. <laughs> Almost every month. If you miss Ugali at your home, yeah. means that you eating something which is not healthy. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, how 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 life here? How expense? Uh, how cost of life here? Actually, maybe if someone has a fifty dollar, how many days he can spend it here? Ah, it depends. Uh, it depends. It depends. Yeah, but uh, if, for normal person, not yeah, if you, one. Yeah, if you base on the local food. Yeah. Yeah, a few days. Few days. Day, like like a, how many days, maybe? Yeah, let's say five nights. Five nights. Yeah. Okay. No, more than five nights. Okay. Because Ugali is not that expensive. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's cool. And uh, how much? Uh, how much? Uh, the cheapest, uh, maybe lodge or guest house, or hostels over here. Cheapest one. If someone, cause you know, uh, some people are watching from UK, from United States, Europe. Uh -huh. So maybe they would like to know here, cause Arusha is a very famous city. In ah, the, the cheapest world. one. Yeah. Uh, if you Maybe just how much? Yeah. If you can tell like us single, in dollar form. You yeah, know. like a single room. Yeah. You can get it for about uh, ten dollar. But uh, if you want to book like a hostel, yeah. So you can share a dormitory with others. Yeah. It may cost you starting from five dollar. Five dollar. Five dollar per person and above. But uh, that's uh, like a sharing dormitory. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Like, uh, yeah, guys. You know what? What he means that uh, for that kind of room. If you go inside there, you will pay five dollar, and if someone comes again, he will join you to the same room, but different beds. But every bed has a space for one person, right? Single. Uh, it's like a double deck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a double deck. Okay, nice. And also, um, what uh, what are you telling people? Because I was talking to somebody, he was asking like, I want to get uh, I want to get a boyfriend in, in Africa. 
exactly Tanzania, especially Tanzania when because uh, she planned to come here this year, but unfortunately because of these COVID issues, she couldn't come. I think next year she will come here. She's my friend from Russia, and she said that uh, I would like to meet with someone, and we'll see where it goes. Maybe we can marry. I can marry him or what? And what are you advising? Because we have other people, maybe they would like to have international yeah. love. So yeah. what are you advising? It's possible, totally possible. Uh -huh. Yeah, also here, you know, we don't have like a... We don't choose. Okay. We, we welcome everybody. Yeah. And then we... You can have a relationship with anyone, we don't choose. Okay. So that's also, there is high possibility. Okay. It depends on your agreement and something like that, so... Uh, how hard it, it is to have a relationship with a... Uh, it's easy. Yeah. It's easy because uh, it's not hard. Yeah. Yeah, because also most of uh, Tanzanian guys, uh, people from Arusha, they are attracted with uh, foreigners. Foreigners, so... Okay. That's so nice. It depends on your interest. Okay, okay. But be careful on selection. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Like yeah, yeah. Uh, how? What, why are you saying that? Ah, sometimes you may find someone who is not the right person. Okay. So before, before, before you want. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, okay, thank you so much for that. But a uh, few questions, like we're going to finish soon, but I have a few questions. Um, can you, how many languages do you speak, Michael? Ah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, how I many? Because I, I know over here, like myself, hey guys, myself, I speaking uh, like uh, a little bit of Spanish, English, Swahili, and my tribes. You know, over here in Tanzania, we have more than 100 tribes, right? Yeah, so myself, international, uh, for those uh, official languages like uh, English, Swahili is my mother language, I mean, my native language, and also Spanish, I can try and like a little bit Germany. But how about you, my brother? Mambo VP. Uh, yeah. That's Swahili, number yeah. one. Okay. Number two, English. Okay. Ciao. Come start. What's that? Italian. Italian. Yeah. And also, uh, I can speak uh, uh, some Japanese. I can speak Japanese. Konnichiwa. Oh. Genki desu ka? Oh. Very nice. Yoko so tomodachi. Oh. This yeah. guy is so talented. For sure. So, uh, anyway, how. How if I want to greet somebody in, in uh, which language? Italian. Italian. How can I like greet a, someone? Ciao, ciao is like a hello. Ciao, ciao. Ciao. Ciao is like a hello. Yeah. And how do you respond? Maybe someone... Ciao, greeting. ciao. You say ciao. Ah, ciao, ciao. ciao, ciao. Another word you want to teach me at least two words? Ah, come, come stai. Come stai. Yeah. What it's does like it how mean? Doing? Ha oh. How doing? How Okay. Uh, if, if you are feeling good, you say bene. Bene. Yeah. Okay. Molto bene, molto bene. Okay. Very good. Okay. Uh, it's like in Spanish, when uh, to greet someone, you have to say, Hey, como estas? So, myself, I can answer, muy bien. That means, how are you? Uh, you, can, you can just answer, very good is muy bien. But when someone say, como estas, you, you have to just answer, bien, you know. When you say muy bien, it's very, very good, you know what I mean? So that is Spanish, and also you can tell him maybe, uh, I just want to tell him maybe like, like, uh, hasta la proxima. That means, uh, see you next time. <laughs> it's a little bit so, thank you so much, my brother. You can give yourself a shout out, maybe if you have Instagram, you want to drop some shout out to people, they can, you can get some followers on Instagram, because people maybe they will be attracted guys to be in Arusha more than 20 years it's not easy because uh, this guy knows many places you know knows many places so if you want to come here he can also take you around you know so all, uh, all in all you can drop a comment maybe if you, so let's let's give him a chance just to give himself a shout out maybe uh, if he has Instagram or Facebook so you can get in touch with him, maybe. Yeah. Do you have any social media, bro? Oh, interesting. Yeah, okay. it's like uh, I have uh, Facebook. Okay. What's your username on Facebook? It's Mike. 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 Yeah. Uh, you start with a capi capital letter. Okay. Capital letter M. Okay. Mike. Uh huh. Then uh, Emmanuel. 
Okay. But you, you have to put space. Space and then yeah. cap, capital letter E. Okay. And Emmanuel, double M. Okay. Yeah, Emmanuel is double M. Thank you. Yeah, Thank and you. then you you'll see you'll see my photo like uh, wearing like a mountain jacket. Wow. Yeah, so you'll just see snow around me. Oh. Okay. So that's me. Uh, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button if you are new one and also smash a like button man just to support your boy. All in all you have listened to him. Even myself, check me on Instagram WegMDC, Facebook WegMDC, the same name you using I'm using in this YouTube channel. Search me on Instagram and Facebook also so maybe sometimes you can because uh, sometimes on Facebook when you're trying to search somebody they can bring a lot of them so if you are confusing hit me up on uh, check me out on uh, Instagram or Facebook text me just let me know if you need this guy because he's my friend actually we are so many times I'm with him you know so that is all guys thank you for watching this video thank you for your time may God bless you Continue to support. I know you have many things to do. You have a lot of millions channels on YouTube, but you chosen mine. So that is special shout out to you. May God bless you. See you to my next video. That means uh, hasta la proxima. Can you say bye? Ciao, ciao. Ci vediamo. Ci va what is that? Ci vediamo. Wh which language? See you is that? then. That's yeah. Italian. Italian. Yeah, you hear? We shall meet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you very much, my brother. I miss the way we were before Everybody